We're watching Guts. Oh. Do, 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 do you have it? Guts. Should I skip the intro? Oh, I don't know how this device oh. works. Turn me down a little, Matthew. From Nickelodeon Studios in Orlando, Florida. What's the skip? Is it 11? Is first one? It's L. L. L will skip us a little bit. Thanks, Matt. And now, look, this is a warehouse. We can take the warehouse into this. Yeah. Okay. Do you have a choice right away? Ooh. Red's tallest. Off and... the rip, I'm I'm purple. I'm rooting blue, though. I'm okay. an underdog. Uh, you know? I'm rooting red to dominate or fail miserably in the last round. Maddie, can you turn me up a little bit? The blazing blue from Southwest Middle School. Nervy, Nikki, Heitner! Nikki. Yeah, I'm rooting, but I'm not believing currently. Okay. Which could be like also an archery. Wow. All right. He's cocky. He thinks he's going to crush that. There's a reason he's the big favorite. From Edgewater High School, Robert the Bull. Oh, yeah, I don't know. He, ooh. Oh, I don't. Wow, I don't know what to expect. Can we him. rewind? I'm feeling the confidence. I'm about it. I need you to go. Right he gives here. a little shoulder wiggle that I can't tell if that's peacocking or At I'm going to be point, awful. I thought he was so confident. Right. Like a he was calm, locked in. subtle confidence. Right there, he was like kind of Kind of like, gives like a we got like, ice. Like in the zone bobble. And then when he The went, shoulders just got too droopy. And then they went up and I. That could be advantageous though. Good shoulders. Bad spotlight work by the spotlight cam guy. He just couldn't find him. Hello, I'm Michael O'Malley. Welcome to the Extreme Arena, home of Nickelodeon Guts. The Extreme Arena. He I never knew that was the official name. Sports fantasies. Today, our players will be battling their way through four outrageous events, and then after that, they'll get a chance to tackle <laughs> oh, our radical <laughs> rock, the Agro Crag, where almost anything can happen. Translates the player with the most points rock. at the end of all of our events is the winner, and after that, he or she will be Gentle. able to take home after a glowing that. piece of our radical rock. Agro. Now remember, all of our events are specifically designed with our players' safety in mind. I we think I followed Mo on Instagram the last you did. time we did these. She was like a mom. She was doing well. New heights. How else can you hit a target 11 feet high in the air? Only was I think it's going to be best for us to just skip cord. this. We call Trying to dodge. It's also the more you win. The bullseye. Let's we kind of get Mark it. Quirk for the rules. Mo, talk Mo. to me. Okay, well, Mike, at the sound of my whistle, all three players will grab a crossbow and jump off the aerial bridge. The object Laura. of the game is to score as many bullseyes as possible in 60 seconds. Okay. Taking a lot more serious than our warehouse refs because she has an accent. Yes, we should make sure our... Yeah. We, we'll have have we do, we do color accent. commentary accents. Yeah. yeah. That platform... They will be grabbing onto their crossbows and jumping away, archery. and you will soon. I didn't see know that was going to be an event, but I said maybe she's going to archery. It looks like they're safe and ready to go. So let's get option. the crossbows in the hand, and we'll take it for the mark from Mora. Mora, take it away. Okay, uh, kids, when you're ready. My confidence in Robert is shooting down every time they show him. I'm rooting for Nikki in this event. Oh, she went high. Is it supposed to stick? There's always a kid that can't get back up. So the oh, it is supposed to stick. Okay. And so far, Tony the Tiger's got one. Oh, Nikki. Tony's dangling. I don't know. This, this feels one. like an early up. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't have the, the recovery figured out. I mean, to have a running clock. and I mean, no. Robert's gotten one shot off. Nikki's gotten three. Oh, and she's over for three. This is a set. Okay, oh, there's wow. Robert. And, back up. and he's got the bounce. All and right. Another one. Oh, look at that ponytail, dude. Nikki, this is your last shot, so make it count. Come on, she gets Nikki. A good hop. Oh, oh, Tony's got one, and, and and Robert missed. So Tony's in the lead, and Robert didn't have a good Nikki, you going to get another one off? No, she's not. Come on. Come on, girl. No, and he's just totally Come on. stuck. Get it off. Oh, oh, she got it off, and she had the right height, but just... Bricks. She got like five shots off. Robert got two. Wow. Like got the score. Looks like Tony oh, the yeah. Tiger Ferrari got three targets on there. But we're going to go to get the official results from our referee, Morris. Official Morris results. We saw okay. It. In that event, our winner was Tony in red with three target bullseyes. We have Robert. How could you cook the books? Okay. Now. Hands a clipboard. Robert can't just count throwing to three. Them. Play on that Tony the Tiger Ferrari Ferrari revving up his engines. Ferrari for his Ferrari. Let's take a yeah. look at him hitting his, his, name uh, Tony I Ferrari? his third arrow onto the I don't know. target. Tony with a nice aerial jump. 
two feet on the ground. You know, that was really solid. Oh, did he kind of, oh my God, his support girl is cheering. I hope the workers High of energy. this show bet. I hope they bet on the kids, the workers. Felt just like being like Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan, you heard it from the Michael man Jordan himself. Disagrees. All right, now let's go to Mark, work our referee. Kid, you got no so idea. Get, check out the leaderboard. Mark, talk to me. You okay, be Mark. well, first place in our... Hey, we got 100 points, Nikki. Okay. Didn't deserve that. I'll be honest. Third place, 100. It's weighted, so by the end. Remember I tried to steal this for a game show we were going to make? All right. Because by the end, you can just get snaked. And now it's going to be a chance for Nervy Nikki to spill her right. guts. So, Nikki, spill your guts. I love when they spill guts. their guts. Bad pick. Nervy Nikki Bad nickname. Nervy? She's a very accomplished swimmer who's had the chance she snorkeled in Mexico once. Mexico. Very accomplished swimmer? Sure. What's that mean? I mean, she snorkeled in Mexico. Water. And that's Nikki, yeah. That's all she's and got. Nikki, uh, yeah. I mean, d where's she from? Because if she's from this, California, raced in it. Well, yeah, that's not. Like, snorkeling in Mexico is not that impressive. Our players feet as they bounce around our track in a moon shoes race. Oh, Let's no. Moon shoes are tough, man. Imagine we do a moon shoes race. All three players will bounce around our 300-foot track. Players must stay in the assigned lines and if uh, the shoulder work on Robert, he's bouncing already. My prediction is... I think she's going to go slow and steady, and Robert's just going to fucking fall. <laughs> My prediction is... Whoa, he's going two-foot hop? Wow. They all kind of are. Whoa. Nikki getting the inside lane is massive. Oh, no, oh. Nikki. I mean, look at Robert go, dude. Dude, that's tired. Tony is pissed. Is he going to catch up on the straightaway? Oh, did she just go down again? Okay, no. Come on, Nikki. We're so wrong. Come on, Nikki. Come on, Nikki. Come on, oh, Nikki. No! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did Tony beat him in the end? Making it across in third place. A fantastic race. Let's go to Mora. Peace. Tony's so upset. Results. There he is. There is the winner. Robert the Bulltor. Mara, Robert talk the Bull to Toro. me. What's the result? Okay, in first place, it's Robert in purple. In nice. second place, it's Tony in red. And taking <laughs> taking third place. For how Nikki close Nikki was for falling twice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she <laughs> went too fast for her own feet. If she could find a middle ground. Like, she was going 90% and falling. She needed to go 80% and not fall. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, and that was close to the finish line. Look at God, Tony. Being young and just willing to fall. Yeah, I mean, you still do that. I saw you, like, completely slide in Blitzball Battle 3. I thought I was in there most of the That's making a play. That's nothing. He didn't feel the ground. He was flying. He was hopping. It was a moon. I think he race. said. Now tell me. I think he just said that like I was in aerospace. Feel to be on those trampolines. There you go. I thought I was in the air most of the race. I didn't feel the ground most of the time. I thought I was in the air for most of the race. He was hopping. Yeah, no, he was steady. Which they showed Nikki at the end walking, and it looked quicker. Just straight up walking, like power walking. Yes. Imagine if they would they would can the event. What are their bleachers like? Can we snake that idea for the warehouse? First place, we have both Tony and Nikki. We need a big round. With 500 points in third place. Is it gonna be the jungle gym? With 200 points. Is it? I have a question. A Did Robert you impress you? More, so you um, yeah, because he he had a plan. He stuck with it. Okay. Like his consistency. Yeah. Never wavered. Yeah, he just kind of found he was that skip. Soccer nightmares coming up. Let's go. I like that for Nikki. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Everyone's opening with okay. The action sports show that asked, "Do you have it?" Yes. All right. Before we get on to our there next I event, am. we're gonna have Tony the Tiger spill his guts. Tony, spill your guts. Spill your guts, Tony. <laughs> Pukes <laughs> everywhere. Let's, let's reverse. Jay. Jay. Hit it a couple times. I mean, just he goes. He goes gross. It's good. How do you play space bar? Gonna have Tony the Tiger his spill his guts. Tony, spill your guts. Yeah, it's good. For <laughs> There's an extra gross. Tony yeah, the Tiger yeah. Ferrari is 12 years Basketball old. Basketball player this loves the water. This gifted athlete always mauls the competition, winning trophies in baseball, basketball, and soccer. Recently, he was seen prowling around the neighborhood during a TP raid. Mad man. 
Huh? If they bring this back, we've got a chance to host, right? Yes. Like, we're actually, like, on the list. But I think it's secret hosting, like how we do code names. And the kids uh, never get to watch. No. They get shown a different version. Onto the tight rope walk down the slide for life. Maybe I'm out on the course and I'm being nice to the kids and you're just ripping them. Yeah. And then finally down on the free fall. Coach Ball Games the, the host of the pretty kids. Simple. Let's talk yes. tomorrow. Mark. We're, the, we're the adult Mike, version. That's awesome, man. Yeah. We should pitch that. You get two shows. Yeah. You do one thing. Oh, you, have the adult adult, you have the adult You have the adult commentary and then you have the kids two commentary. Shows in one. Yeah, so it, you're okay. filming one show, but two different commentators go to two different networks. Should we call Coach Ballgame right now? No, he'll, but he'll be in. Yeah, okay. From starting line to free fall. Who's that? Is that Nikki? They must complete yeah. she looks each different. obstacle before moving on to the next one. Best time wins. So, on your mark, get set. Oh, I don't like her going first Maybe here. First She's the youngest. She um, that's a bad start. I mean, that's as bad as... Uh, can I tell you something? I'm right. bad at that. 11 seconds up the rope. Note that. Nikki, this is timed. Listen. <laughs> She's doing something else. 23 to the swing. Now the jungle gym. I thought they were doing soccer nightmares. I mean, it does oh. get decided at the jungle gym. Okay. Wow, she did good there. Yeah. One okay. of the boys will mess that up. Come on. Come on. Come on. The sense of the urgency hustle. is not there. There was no, I mean, at no point did she sh look like she was in a race. So, <laughs> <laughs> I'll say for some athletes, that's good, right? Like, yeah. you're not. And she, fall, she fell so much in moon shoes, maybe she was like, yeah. just go easy. Let them fall. Look how small it is in actuality. Because if there's a mistake here, she's got a chance. All right, here goes Tony. Because he's a tiger. Well, I think this is where things change. Yeah, that was very similar. Uh, yeah, that's ooh. Oh, see? Oh, that's a better method. She was 23 to the swing, and he's 21, okay. so he's got two seconds okay. on her right now. And he's big, so it's going to be tougher for Mess him to up go the through elastic. here. Try to go high, Tony. Oh, he knows. Oh. Oh. But uh -huh. oh, the urgency that he's going to show up this wall that she did. This is going to be the game changer. Oh, the long legs helped. Again, three seconds. If she's a little more urgent yeah. at a couple pivotal points. Yeah, close. Tony in red finishes in 43.2 seconds. Okay, so it is close between Can I have one and more two. Crushing We're going to go to the Robert the Bull. I have to tell Toro. everyone something. Mo is there for the in-house audience. I just realized that. Because right. they don't know. We're seeing the graphics. Yeah. Okay, what's your crushing news? Scoreboards and stuff. Um, Look how small it is. I have Toro the Bull. Yeah. 45. Like, Jess edges out Nikki, which is really tough because I think she gave a great effort. Now, you there. know in my heart of hearts, I want him to be at 50. Okay. There's nothing funnier than when a kid tries to go high in the elastic jungle. Yeah. Let's take it away, Mike. That's all I root for in this event. Set. Someone tried to take the elastic jump. Oh, he just jumped into the <laughs> net. <laughs> but now he's still got so much hustle. Yeah. He beat both of them up that thing. That was a nice last step. Breeze through it. Oh, yes. He's like wow, 10 seconds ahead. Oh, my God. Let's go. And he's low. And he's low. Get the Guinness Book on the phone. Get the Guinness Book on the phone, people. Up. Don't even wow. use the rope. Pose. That's how you do it. Now, Tony oh, has to feel tough sad. He's right crying? There. So excited? I'm, I'm sorry, We got to get off that. That was that. awesome. Okay. That was awesome. And now it even hammers home more how lack of urgent right. the others were. The they kind of walked. Robert and Purple finishes in 28.1 seconds. <laughs> if I'm Nikki, I'm almost like, wait, I didn't think we could run. Yeah. I thought I was just testing. Let's go to the replay and see Robert. You know, there's a big theory online that they always had uh, one girl that was younger to guinea pig it for the boys. Sexist. Doing great. Like the best of a stunt man. I made that up. Robert, okay. you had no trouble at all. What was your favorite part of that whole obstacle course? Beating him. 
don't know where that's called. But the 20 foot slide for life. He's pointing right <laughs> up there. You did a great job. Let's go to the let's go to the leaderboard. Got a lot of right Solano in. A lot of Joes. I don't know. That's called 20 foot Robert slide for life. With 800 yeah. points in second. Solid Nikki consistent red effort by points. Nikki. And in third, Nikki in blue with 300 points. Yeah. yeah. The bull. The bull taking the lead. I'm bullish about his future. Now it's time to spill his guts. Bull man, spill your guts. Ooh. Robert. The oh, I did not girl. think he was going to be a horseback rider. Thir he's, he's 13? Yeah. He's he jumped off a two-story roof once, dude. <laughs> so have we. So have we, yeah, into the snow. Uh, horseback rider. Don't think so. I think he did it once. Ooh, I don't know. To say you've done that once and put it out there. I mean, she snorkeled in Mexico once. Right, but here you go. This is your event. I'm so out on Nikki. Well, she's the youngest. In this event, each don't they have player the will have age? 30 seconds to defend their goal against two cannons shooting soccer we balls literally at them. Divide the youth player sports to block the most balls wins. Cannons so players get your places and on your mark, this get your set. Dream. We've talked about this on, oh my God. Oh my God. No, I mean, they're just dicing Nikki up. Who's counting? This is unofficial. There you go, Nikki. I mean, just start shooting them at her, guys, and like lift her spirits a little. He's not getting any shots. Dude, they absolutely cooked. The oh wow, they cooked the books on this. Nikki's not getting any shots, and they're lighting up Robert. <laughs> I mean, the variables here are ridiculous. Red guy has lost my trust completely. Look at all the balls on that side, Dude. and none of them by Nikki. You couldn't watch any of that. They can just make it up. And is for just that player, looks like Moore's got the results. Ma, what's up? First place goes to Robert in purple with 20 blocks. Nikki. Second place goes to Nikki in blue with wow. 15 blocks. And in Tony. third place with 14 blocks is Tony what in What happened red. is Tony, Tony Spirit got crushed when he saw Robert beat him in the jungle. I mean, this is this is their event to cook the books, but they didn't really even cook them. They got Nikki in the game slightly, but not really. You wanted Red to be their dominant or below? Yeah. Very close to below. Oh, if he loses... Dude, Nikki beats... Red can come in last place, win the first round in last place. I'm in on that. Nikki beats him in the moon bounce if she doesn't trip twice. If yeah. she trips once, she beats him there. And... A little bit of hustle, she beats him in the I think she tripped three times. The game. Robert, now what's your evaluation Fell. of this game? Free kick, you uh, you came out in first again. Oh, no. I guess. <laughs> a lot of Joes. You guess you're happy because you won? Yeah. That's the man. Okay. Now man of little kick. words. Just here to, just here to compete. Just here to kick some ass. Yeah. And get some crag. What if he What if he was like, did you see Nikki beat Tony? <laughs> that was all he said. <laughs> <laughs> see, on the adult broadcast, that's awesome. Yeah. 1,100 points in second. Tony in red with 800 points. And coming in third is Nikki in blue with 500 But I think the aggro crag is worth a ton. Right. Like I think if you win, but I, Nikki's... I don't think Nikki can become first place. Or wait, maybe she can, because... I think if you win and Robert finish last, but it... But it's just points now, right? Like, like Robert's going to get a huge head start. Because of, and then it's all just whoever gets up there first. Good. Oh, yeah. Look at them dancing between innings. Oh yeah, and innings. I like that you're calling commercial breaks. The aggro crag right behind me. You can see it heating up right now. It is getting ready for our. Like I think we could fit an aggro crag in our warehouse. Final event. The lead still in Robert's hands. Be interesting. Tony ball. could definitely get it back this round. Let's go to oh. the leaderboard right now and talk to Mora. Mora. After four events, I'm gonna Google we behind the scenes aggro. How tall is the aggro crag? I told Jess I was like, there's a new, like new big NBA prospect. Guess how tall she is, or how tall he is, and she's like eight feet. I was like, oh, seven five, and she's like, what? She didn't think like humans got there. seven five. I thought it was listed at seven two. Oh. For this aggro crack, now anything can happen on this mountain as they climb up the mountain. They can run into slime floods, rock avalanches, snowstorms. They must hit a bunch of different actuators on the way up. And for actually the rules on this, let's go specifically to our referee, Mora. Mora. Players will start at the sound of my whistle. Each player has an identical size. 22 to 28 feet. So when it was the 22, when it was the... We could get up to 24. 
Because it's 26. Might not be able to stand at the yeah. time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just got to touch the ceiling. You win. The first player to set off all the targets, including the final one at the peak of the mountain, will receive first I'd love to know, points. like, the best step ever. Oh, like, three Seth dogs. His name is Septon Beer. Oh, I don't care about the top performer ever. Oh, okay. I want, like, three dogs. Oh. That we're like back and forth, back and forth. Yes. Like a blowout does nothing for me. Well, you got different if ages. We get to, if like we get to keep watching this, then we'll find that out. Okay, let's go tomorrow. I think the kid named Beer got a perfect score. Brian Beer. So they just go at the same time. So can you come in second but win the whole thing? I thought they yeah. made. Yeah, okay. I like my idea. Or whoever wins the crag is the winner. You just get, but then you probably have dominant, just dominance. They didn't even show Nikki, dude. They're not showing her. The tiger slipped, dude. Is Nikki gonna beat him because he slipped? No. Oh, she's going. She missed an actuator. No, the Nikki. first one. He just missed that button. I mean, that kid just missed that button. Watch his slap. I mean, is he not trying to hit the button? He has to hit that button. I don't know what that was about. Board. Yeah, there she is. She's the, oh, she's there she is. There she is. I had to go further down the mountain to find her. Oh, uh, no. Change the channel. No way. Show the celebration of the others. They're just waiting. I think she's in second place because that dude never lit up his red flags. Purple flags weren't lit either. Maybe they lied and turn off. Yeah. Let's go take a look at the replay. Oh, oh my is, god. Is cartoon old, man. That's such age. That's awesome. You know what? That the woman's actually 70. It was just the 90s. A nice yeah, shot of Robert the Bull at the top of our mountain. Tony having a little bit of What a replay. Just an awful a, replay. A low light replay. A horrible replay. Why don't you just show Robert crushing it? That's loaded down. That slowed her down, having to go back down the whole mountain after coming to the top. At first, I was incorrect on the third place points. Third place points at 375, not 325. And there is the Tiger banging home. Oh, he missed it. on that one. Okay. Never lit it up. So let's now go. Why didn't they show any highlights of Robert? Final results, Mora. Because he won. Well, it seems that the crag has decided it again. Coming in third place so what's today the math? is Nikki in blue. Nobody's in second is Tony Robert in was red. So if Nikki won, she would have had 825. And, and if Robert came in third, he would have six. So she would have won. If, if she won and he came in third, third. she would have won. Yeah. Um, he almost had a perfect game. He finished second in the first event. Nikki. Yeah. Nervy Nikki, here is the bronze. Nervy Nikki, it's so tough. Wonder why she didn't win. And then nervy Nikki against two older. Oh, never nervous <sighs> Nikki. No nerves, Nikki. And now no to nerves. the bull man himself, Robert the Bull, taking home the gold. Mom, um, why is he calling me Robert the Bull? And the glowing Did you tell him? Of our agro His last drag. name's Toro. We're gonna sandblast your right. name into the middle of that, Robert. <laughs> Hold it up and show it back to your name to the middle of Let's that. Let's hear it for our players, ladies and gentlemen. What an app. Can I look up Robert Toro on Instagram? Is that how we end these episodes, or do we decide that's fucking weird? Uh, if it's girls, it's weird. Okay. Robert Toro. Guts. So it's been searched. People know this. There he is. I mean, I think this is an easy find as people watch these old ones. Is it weird that they had their full names? Yeah. But, I mean, that's got to be him. Could be Robert Toro. It comes up when you search Robert Toro Guts. His Guts has, like, a Wikipedia now. I'm an adult. Okay. That's what it asks you on this website. Are you an adult or a kid? I tell you, you wanted to say enough is enough? No, they just quit screaming out, I've got more Guts. What was that? Why are they still going? I think because they have to hit their 24 minutes. Do we call coach or no? I got one thing to say to everybody. 
Maybe. I'll call him Cliff. Yes, hurry! <laughs> Atta boy! I'm just talking from a walkie-talkie. Some people call it an Apple Watch. What are you Ooh. doing? Wow. Uh, we've got one minute. This is our pitch. You know, we're we're all Hollywood guys, so you're either in or out, okay? Wow. Elevator pitch, they call it. <laughs> yep, you're in the game. Uh, all right, so we we read... We, we bring back Guts, the old Nickelodeon, kids compete. Um, the secret, and this is where we sell and we probably win, is there's two broadcasts. There's one that's for kids, like Nickelodeon style, and you're the host. You're on the field. And then there's also the same exact show. There's an adult broadcast that me and Jimmy do. <laughs> so, see, there's a space for R-rated coach ball game. It's just... In you and and James's hearts, we and we mouth. you come into the R rated like poke your head in and people are like whoa they yeah. they both know th- and you give us some you get like a zinger on a kid just one you're like whoa he's gonna go back out there I get one I get one good zinger in it is it's exhausting trying to keep this uh, you know this this buttoned up but this buttoned up deal every now and again I just want to let my hair out you know. I think it might be the perfect forum for that. Well, you had me at hello, and I don't even think he said hello. So, sh- yeah, I'm in. I- I- I'm staring at 100 kids right now, uh, and they're doing a flamingo stretch, and I'm, 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 th- I'm thinking of a milk bath with you boys. I, uh, I'm I'm, my head was in the same place. Tell, uh, tell yeah. those kids John Boy Media says hello and uh, m- might see you soon. Well, the, the moms, the moms are amazing in my line of work. If you know what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> I think we do. The, the moms. Yes. Which is totally, you know, where my mind goes in that R-rated space. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like that. Hey, I'm gonna. Hey, I, you come in and you say, "Hey, I'm gonna move this kid to the next round." His mom's in the crowd. <laughs> <laughs> His mom is very smart. 